Wednesday. Oh, kitty sleeping. Hang on, I'm gonna turn you around. Hang on. Look at her. She's passed out. So peaceful. All right, there's your kitty moment. Okay, I gotta turn off my fan. We, I just got showered, dressed, I gotta put on my thermal and we're running out. We're going to a bakery that is closing uh, on the 31st of December forever. They've been here for like over 40 years, but they wanna retire. Um, they've tried to sell the bakery, but unsuccessful, so they're just gonna, they're done. It's a very successful bakery, so we're going out into the world. I did not film in the bakery because it's a little busy. Everybody's trying to get their last goodies. But I'll show you what we got when we get home. I got some Keefleys. I got a cherry. I can't remember. I'll have to show you when I get home. Dad's in there getting a couple buckets. Uh, he always buys buckets when we come here. But I'll show you their Yoda. Hang on. Look at their happy little Yoda holding a cake. There's a thing, but I love Mr. Yoda. He's so cute. Okay, now we're heading home. We are home. I got, I was gonna get a mocha frappe at McDonald's, but of course the frappe machine's down. So for the first time ever, I got a vanilla iced coffee. I've never had one before, it ain't bad. Not as good as my mocha frappe, but not bad. At the bakery, I got six key fleas because I didn't have very many left. So luckily, I I got six. Uh, this is a cherry uh, Danish thing. I don't know what the name of it is. And here are three apple fritters, two for dad, one for me. I'm going to have one for my breakfast. Well, lunch because it's 12. And this is my tonight's dessert. One chocolate cupcake. So that's what we got. And I ordered... Some more of these for next Christmas season. My containers, because I wanted to do it now while I was thinking about it, because it's about out. These came this morning. I gotta go put them out in my candy making tote. And now I gotta open up a bunch of mail. But yay! For everybody who's wondering, I have a stack of Christmas cards. Whenever I get them, I just throw them in a stack. I haven't even looked to see who sent them. It's gonna be a surprise. I'm probably gonna open them on Christmas Eve. I'll probably make that its own video. So no, I have Christmas cards. So if you're worried that if I've gotten it or not gotten it, it could be here in a stack. That's all I had to say. Is this kitty in her bed? I can't tell. Yeah, she's sleeping. Oh, okay, back to work. We're out. I'm at, outside of an American Legion, and today's taco day. So Dad's running in to get tacos. I already ordered them. And we're gonna take them home. She does soft shell tacos. She does like a menu. She'll put it out at the beginning of the month, and so she does food every Monday and Wednesday. And um, so she has a calendar. She hasn't done tacos in the last month or two. So we are excited to see those. We like our sweetest sweet balls. We haven't had those in a while. Um, April does a good job. Her name's April. She's a very good cook. Now, you'll see when we get home. Our taco. We are home. Here's mine. I got salsa and sour cream. I got two chicken and three beef. And then dad got all beef. And then Kitty's here to check in on us, too. But yeah, she sells these dinners for like $8, which is a good price, really. I don't have to buy all this stuff and make it myself. Yeah. Are you excited about tacos? I am excited. And he's getting all his accoutrement out. He'll probably get his Taco Bell sauce. He's got a little can of jalapenos. Jalapeno, yeah, can't eat without yeah. them. Yeah, so, yeah. But we're going to mow down. Good morning. It's about 9 a.m. I'm uh thursday the, the snow the snowstorm will start about three we're going out to get we have prescriptions in at the right aid we're going to fill up my tank in my van we're going to go get some breakfast to bring home we're going to see how crazy the grocery store looks in the town next to us because i've heard online that it's crazy one lady's like they have no bananas no potatoes they're out of so much stuff because one it's right before christmas and two everybody's freaked out about this weather so we are just going to go get what we need we were originally supposed to go to an appointment up in Benton Harbor, but that appointment got canceled because Dad thinks he's figured out how to make his mask better. So he said, if I if I, if I sell problems, I'll give you a call. So we're rolling out. We're at our first stop right The One good thing is it's still in the 30s right now, but later on as the temperature is supposed to drop 
like drastically into like the single digits. They're saying we sh we could get anywhere between negative 10 and negative 30 wind chills this in the next couple days and 40 and 50 mile an hour winds. I told Dad, I'm like, if we lost power, are we going to freeze to death? We have no other heat source. So I mentioned at the Ron yesterday, and he has a bunch of generators, so I don't know if he's going to bring one up today or not, or have one in case we need it. I don't know. We've never had problems with losing power because we're right on a main grid, so we rarely ever lose power, which is good. But um, we'll see what happens. We're just going to go with it. We do have jugs of water. Uh, we always have jugs of, of water. And we're, ever since I was a kid, we've always had jugs of water. Um, like to flush the toilet if the power went off or stuff like that but okay he should be back out any second the next stop gasoline for breakfast we stopped and got biscuits and gravy from hardy's i haven't been to that hardy's in forever because half the time it's closed because they don't have enough help but it was open for breakfast so two biscuits and gravy hit the spot one for me one for dad Hang on, Dad, ask me a question. Well, it's about 4.30 and the snow started at about 3 o'clock. Oops. But now I'm going to go cook some dinner. For dinner, I'll find out some cute steak. A little, a little flour. Fry in a little olive oil. I got a box of scalp potatoes. Some of the instant things over there cooking. So, yeah. Just trying to get not get topped with grease because you know how that goes. Here we are. I made a side salad, fried us some little cube steaks, and Dad's getting some potatoes. Yep, there's dinner. Yum yum. She passed out, which means she's gonna wake me up at like last night. She was waking me up at 2 a.m. and at 7. All she wants is treats, and then she goes right back to sleep drives me nuts but dinner was very good we have um leftover cube sticks for tomorrow and um i'm gonna start getting my game plan together tomorrow for i'm gonna cook christmas dinner on christmas eve on saturday so that way you know i'm just gonna do that yeah, i'm hoping our oven works fine excuse me I just burped a freeze-dried Skittle. I love freeze-dried Skittles. They're just so crunchy and good. Mm. I looked up. Hey, Matt. She swallowed. When I went to the holiday bazaars and stuff, I looked to see if anybody had a set up with freeze-dried candies. But I didn't. But I found them on Amazon. I kept getting... I did a search. Well, I saw an ad on Facebook. If you look at one ad, then you get 15 million ads of that. And I'm like, well, I'll look on Facebook. Because most of the ones you see are like 5 ounce, 6 ounce bags. I got me a pounder. So I have... It's over there. That bag right there. They are so good. It's the only freeze-dried candy I really liked. I didn't like any of the freeze-dried chocolates or I, Skittles. That's it for me. Okay, I'm just babbling. I've been doing that a lot lately. I'm a babbler. I just put clips together from Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Wait, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday? Or is it just Monday, Tuesday? I just put some clips together. I'm getting ready to load to YouTube, which I'll put up tomorrow, Friday. But then I'll have another one. Maybe I'll put up two tomorrow. Maybe I'll do Friday morning, Friday evening. I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen, people. But okay. I'm going to wrap this up and put, up, put another video together. Bye.